So she'll go back and get ready. And here we go. There's your start list for the second of three semi-finals here tonight. Lane two, Tavlene Singh from New South Wales. Lane three, Kyla King from New South Wales. Lane four, Lucy Sheep from New Zealand. Lane five, Brittany Burkett from Victoria. Lane six, Melissa Breen from the ACT. Lane seven, Kendra Hubbard from the Victoria. Lane eight, Abby Goldie from New Zealand. And rounding out the field in lane nine, Hannah Basic from Victoria. That is your lineup for the second semi final for this Women Open 100 metres. As we see the athletes getting down into the blocks, they're in the starters' hands. And as we would expect, fast start there by Breen, but she's been pushed on the inside by Burkett. Burkett and Breen at the moment, but Breen starts to move away from Burkett. She's going to be too strong. She's going to run away this one and take the win, followed by Burkett. 11.69 unofficial. It's obviously not lightning fast. The win. 1.1. Is a 1.1. I'm assuming that's a plus. It's a bit blurry from here, but we'll give it a plus. So plus 1.1. So at least we got the tailwinds out there. As predicted as well, Mel Breen sort of gets to the front and relaxes up a little bit and pulls her to the line, looks comfortable as well. Brittany Burkett for second. She's had a good season, had the opportunity to run first leg in the women's 4x1 uh, down in Canberra about three weeks ago. So that's great to see a young talent have an opportunity there. And yeah. looks like we're going to throw down to Thames and she's down there with Melissa Breen from the ACT. I am here with Mel and that was a fantastic race. We ran down the back straight. We had a tailwind. Happy? Oh, yeah, I am. Um, had a little bit of a stumble at the start there, but um, no, it's great. And hopefully some of the girls can get some PBs out of tonight. That's okay. Um, it was only the semi-final. You did it really comfortably. Job done. On to the final. Goal for the final? Yeah, that would be great. Um, see, to having a great battle with Toya. She's had me all season, so hopefully, fingers crossed in the final, I can turn it around. Well, we would love to see that because obviously we are rooting for the Aussie girl. We'd love to see you take the win tonight, Mel. Good luck. Thanks very much.